transmission. I'm telling you, wonderful way to get up to the microphone, ain't it? Good evening, everybody. First thing I like to say, Murray, I love you. I love you. When I first met Murray, I was at a cabaret, and there was a gentleman dancing up on the dance floor called Dancing Tony. And I saw this lady dancing with him. And I looked at her and I said, my God, look at that queen work. I mean, it was the most graceful thing you've ever seen on a dance floor in motion. A female dancer. And I've always wanted to be the king, like she was the queen of dancing. I never got the title, believe me. <laughs> Tony got it. But Murray, if you ever need a king when you're out there dancing on that dance floor, believe me, I will be more than glad to come help you. She's wonderful, y'all, on the dance floor. Thank you, Murray. I love you. My name is Bill Gurley, and uh, it's an honor for me to come up here and speak. You know, it, it is good to have gone through life and have touched somebody. Very few people get a chance to do that, you know. They go through this life, you know, and they get through that. And we you know I was thinking, you know, I, I was taking pictures. I'm, I'm the photographer tonight, and it's a good time for me to get up here to give you an excuse for not getting the pictures. My, my battery went dead in my camera, so I said, well, at least I can go up here and let them know. But I, I want to say that how you touched me as an individual. You know, my, uh, my sister died a long time ago. And God have a way of working through people. And I think that when, 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 I, when, I, when I come in contact with Murray, and I know Murray way back. And I used, to, I used to watch Murray all the time, you know, and I was saying to myself, and both of us are Scorpions. There's something about Scorpions. We know how to live and we know how to love, you know. And I, I, I also call and get that thing on the telephone, you know. If you really want to be free, love is a key. And I know that, but there's so many people who don't actually share that. And, and, and when I see you go out, you touch a lot of people, you know. And, you know, I go to hospitals, too. So a lot of people should start going to hospitals, you know, before they get there. They, they know what will happen when they get there. You know? But I think that it's something about you that just light up the room. You know, a lot of times, uh, 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 and I, you know, before I retired, I worked with a lot of evil people. And it's hard going to work with people that don't, you don't know what to say good morning or, or goodbye. <laughs> if, if you say good morning, you're wrong. If you say goodbye, you're wrong. Uh, you know, but uh, and when, 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 you, when you come in contact, some contact with somebody like yourself, you know, it, 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 it works me. It wakes me up. It tells me that I'm alive. You know, so many people are thinking about dying. There's something about you about living. You know, the, 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 the picture of you on the, on the fly here, it, it tells something about you. You're alive. You know, and I, you know, I was out in, out in Denver, Colorado at one time, and I went in this place, and everybody was laying down, you know, looking at, crying at a drink and shit like that. I said, well, look, I'm in the wrong place. I don't want to go to the graveyard. I want to be around people that are living. And Murray, it's an honor for me to come up here. And from, from silly from my heart, I want to tell you that I love you. Thank you. I'm going to be brief, but I've only known Mary about two years. But it's been a great two years. I'm not giving her flowers today because Mary and I give gifts all the time. And I got some popcorn too. <laughs> and when I was sick and I wasn't out at Oldies, she remembered me and sent me things. She's just always doing great things. And I try, every time we go on trips, we bring things back to each other. So she's just been a delight to know. Many, many times you meet people and you just, something doesn't click, but when I met Mary, the first night I went Breeze's Metro, um, well, Dino's, whatever, um, it just clicked. I was sitting there and she said, come on and cha-cha with us. And we exchanged numbers that night and ever since then, it's been a beautiful friendship. She's seen me through some ups and downs and we talked about, shared a lot of confidences and I can just say, right now she's one of my best friends. Good evening. My name is Florine, and it is indeed a pleasure, Mary, to be able to get up here and have the opportunity to uh, really say hello and good wishes to a good friend, which with me, 
I sort of stand back and observe you first. And with some females, you know, with that vibration, I really have to get that positiveness, you know, in order to say, hey, or hello, or whatnot. But however, Mary, it has been, a, a, you know, good times, that and a pleasure knowing you. And first, ladies and gentlemen, I was a little hesitant in getting up here because I had the, I guess, the, uh, the pleasure, or either I should say I was eating crabs, and I broke my tooth. <laughs> so my daughter said, wow, mom, so why'd you do that? I said, well, they were so good, and I didn't use the crab to do that. So that's one reason why I was, you know, sort of took back before coming up. But Mary, it's really been a joy. And like I want to say to God grant those who are really, truly friends. And it is really, you know, a pleasure to me saying that I'm one and you are my friend. Thank you. Hello, Mary. Peaches. I just wanted to say to you that you have a lovely, sweet spirit. And I thank God for bringing you into my life. Thank you. Hello everyone, my name is Jeffrey, Jeffrey Barbie. Mary, I'd like to share a few words. And I, first of all, I'd like to say it's all praises are due to God for giving me this opportunity to say these words. Mary, you're very special. I knew that there was something special about you when we first met years ago. And I knew that you had something going for you. But the first uh, incident that really moved me and still moves me every time I see Mary is the expression of love that she shared with my family when my mother died in 93. I mean, I'll never forget that. I mean, she sent a gift to us that, that still moves me. Every time I look at it, I just get goose pimples and say, man, that lady is something else. Very special. And uh, here's something, Mary. I, if I stay up here too much longer, tears will be coming out of my eyes. You're very special. You are our friend, Patricia and I's friend. And we love you very, very much. And don't break the rhythm. Hi, my name is Irene. I've only known Mary about four years. I was in a club and this little voice said, can I sit there beside you? <laughs> and from there, it's gone on. Not only has she become my friend, but now she had my children running to the oldest and they can't even dance. <laughs> The one thing that I think is so special, really special about Mary that t takes uh, my breath away, is she makes you feel so damn special. She makes you feel like you're worth a million dollars. And when I call her, I leave a message. I say, I call the chat. I need to talk so she knows whether to call me back. But she has always made me feel that I was real special. Thank you, Mary. Mary, all I can say is you don't want to make me leave somewhere how we really engage in something today. And I gotta put a suit on which I don't like. But you are my partner. And for my partner, my comrades, the four of us, we love you to death. Mary Williams. Good girl. <laughs> I did something that no one, I don't believe, would do. I have done. I adopted Mary a long time ago as a family member. Long time ago, because you're a great inspiration. You keep me activated, brains-wise. Thank you very much. And not only Mary, because she is a phenomenon, it's James, James Jr. And the James's uh, fiance, the whole gambit and the other son that's not here. They really did it. And um, I can't even express the things that I, that I dig in you, the whole entire family. Thank you. Thank you very much for the Williams family. God bless you. You have all this on tape, don't you, Mary? Yeah, I'm doing the best I can with I want to, oh no, please. Uh, Mary, on the back, on the back, back-to-back -back production, would like to present you with a small gift.
for your timeliness and all the things that you do. You never forget a birthday. You never forget um, when people are having hard times. You're always there. You always support us in whatever we do. And we really appreciate that. And we want to want you to come. <laughs> this is a small token of our appreciation to you. Appreciation to Murray Williams from Maxine and Bird, 1995. We love you, Murray, and we appreciate everything you've done for us. And now, Tony, if you would please forgive me. Today you cannot be the king. We have another king among us, and that's Mr. James Williams Sr. Mary. King I am around here. <laughs> but I'd like to thank y'all for coming out to honor my wife. Uh, I think she's the greatest person I've ever met besides my mother in the world. And uh, what can I say? You said it all. Uh, she, she does good for people. She tries to help people. And uh, I'm just glad to be part of her household. <laughs> thank you. Please go to the back. All to the lady on the committee. Please go to the back. Gloria. Mary Williams. This is your barber. Mary Jones Williams, a native Washingtonian from the southwest section of the city, was born on the zodiac sign of Scorpio. Mary attended Marble Murray Washington Vocational High School in George Washington University, where she graduated with honors and subsequently achieved a master's degree in library science from the University of Merle. Married for 28 years to James Williams. Two sons from the union were born, Ronald and James Williams, Jr. Mary's harbors include an active interest in outreach and self-help groups, social work for senior citizens, and she really enjoys dancing. Murray also is actively involved in the Choice Club as their chairperson and is the current sponsor and chief benefactor of the Pookie Hudson Landmark Theater production. Once again, Murray, we want to thank you for being the beautiful person that you are. Marvelously personable, generous, and kind. Adorable hats of every shape and kind. Radiant smiles that delight the heart and soul, yielding always to others, young and old. Our friend Murray, we love you. The OF Murray FOM Committee. Now our, our committee members, Maxine Grant, Adrian Poti. Excuse me, big change. Okay. Don't go anywhere. 
before the committee does their presentation. And we're sorry we didn't tell you, Lee, but you know how women are. We change things at the last minute. <laughs> We'd like to call Poogie Hudson. He'd like to honor us with a selection just for you, Mary. Poogie, please come forward. <laughs> 